Ready. Andrew Gritzbosch, SHOT Show 2013. We're at the Gerber booth. We're going to talk about a few new products we have that are uh, that are great products, uh, both for the military end user and for the everyday tactical kind of guy. Um, starting out as kind of a flagship product, this is the downrange Tomahawk. A lot of Tomahawks on the market. A lot of them are great products, have a good use, but the majority of them tend to be kind of glorified axes. So most of our product development strategies are focused on end users. What's the end user going to do? with this product, we approach this product with that mindset. So the downrange tomahawk is designed for breaching. You're gonna have three primary functions. You have an ax head and a puncture point here. You've got a hammer head that's actually welded on. And then you've got a pry bar here that's got a slight cant in it too. You can see the handle actually doesn't go all the way to the bottom. It's recessed a bit so you can really get it into tight spaces. What's really innovative about this is the way the ax head is shaped. So you've got real estate up here that's designed for leveraging that crow or that pry action. So the blade, the hammerhead, and the pry will help you get in and out of any kind of hut, uh, vehicle, or situation you need to breach or get out of. So, awesome product, made out of incredibly durable materials, 100% American made, 420 high carbon steel, heat treated, coated in KG gun coat. So you can you can really put some work on this guy. Tan 499 G10 scales, lightweight, incredibly durable, totally full tank construction. So when you're getting into that pry action, you can really rely on this to do the job. So awesome piece of kit. This is going to be about 280 bucks. Should be uh, available in about 30 days or so. Uh, next in the line is some really exciting flagship products for us. Uh, this is these are two new automatic knives. We're calling these the Propel series knives. The tan one's called Downrange S30V steel. G10 handles just like you see on the Tomahawk. The G10 actually wraps around the inside of the liner here so you have a nice positive controlled feel all the way around the knife. You're not kind of touching different materials and, and getting slippage. So uh, based kind of on our 06 platform, a really strong spring mechanism. You've got a safety mechanism here that locks the blade. Hit that down, red dead, deploy it just like that with one single lock. You can also lock it in the engaged portion too. So um, really high quality product. Another innovative piece of this is the tip. So you've got a Tonto tip, but it's got a slight modified curve to it. So some guys are really awesome. They love that a Tonto tip because they're going to do stabbing or prodding or prying. Other guys like the modified drop point because they want to slice. So this is kind of the middle ground between both of those things. You've married up those two strong blade types and get the best of both worlds. So awesome new product here. We've also got the Propel series. This is the black version. This is a 420 high carbon steel, but all the other properties of the knife are the same. So we've got a slightly lower price point. Black, G10, same great quality, 06 automatic kind of uh, opening mechanism. Really great stuff. These are going to run about 160 bucks MSRP. We've also got these two same platforms available in assisted openings. So if you're in a state where an automatic is illegal and you don't want to get in trouble with Johnny Law, you can carry the AO version, slightly less expensive too. So really great solutions for just about anybody or any way you want to carry it. Last point on these is you've actually got a reversible pocket clip. So if you like a tip up, tip down, left handed, you can modify this to meet your individual needs. Next to the lineup here are three new lights from Gerber. Uh, we've been in the personal lighting business for quite a while. These are a little bit more tactical and everyday carry uh, appropriate. The first guy here is the Cortex light. This is the mini pocket version. You've got uh, two modes, high, which is very bright, excuse me, and then you've got low. You've also got strobe. You've got a pocket clip here. It's very lightweight. The great thing about all of these flashlights in the suite are they take two different types of batteries. We call this omnivore technology. So you can dump CR123s in here, or you can dump double A's in here. Either way, you're gonna get the same output. The only thing that's affected is the runtime. So great everyday carry pocket night uh, light. Next guys here, the, the Cortex series, the full-size versions. You've got the battery-operated Cortex here. This takes three CR123 batteries or two double A batteries. Great hand feel, pocket clip here, so it's not gonna move around in your pocket. Uh, you got two modes, you got, you got on, and then you got strobe. Click it for constant on too. And uh, lightweight, these are going to come in just under 600 lumens. So these are bright. These are going to do some serious damage at nighttime if you took this in the face. The second piece here is identical in the shape, size, and output. The only difference is it's rechargeable. The Cortex rechargeable. So awesome piece of gear. Comes with a chargeable battery inside of it. What's great about this is you don't have this big bulky plastic device you have to set this into and take up real estate. It's just like your cell phone or your iPad or anything else. It's a mini USB. So you plug that mini USB in there, you're good to go. Can't find a plug? Drop that into your laptop or computer. You can also get a small charge from that. So, really a great solution for a guy on the go. You got to keep stuff in your pack, and you don't know what resources you're going to have in the future. So, great new products from the uh, Tactical Collection on the Gerber side of the booth. Really excited about this stuff. It's a uh, Shot Show 2013. These products will all be available within 30 days to, uh, to March 1st. You can find out more information on GerberGear.com. Thanks.